The following tutorial will discuss how to attend a meeting that is being hosted by the University of Portland using WebEx. As somebody who's attending the meeting, you should have received an email from the WebEx Messenger that has all the information that you need to attend the meeting. I'm going to go ahead and pull up the email for the test meeting that I've scheduled. In the meeting invitation email you receive, um, you have the topic, the date, the time, the meeting number, meeting password, and the link to join the meeting. To join the meeting, you would simply click on the link. This will open up the WebEx page for the University of Portland. You will put your name and the email address that you use to sign up for this meeting. Once you've put your name and your email address, go ahead and click on Join. Once your WebEx meeting has started, you're going to get the audio conference dialog box. In that dialog box, you want to go down to the bottom and open up the Use Computer for Audio. So if you're going to be using a headset, or if you're going to be using a built-in microphone on a webcam or on your computer, you would want to click on Call Using Computer. If you want to test your audio, you want to click on the Test Speaker and Microphone link under the Call Using for Computer. You can now test the speaker. So in this case, if I, since I'm wearing a headset, I'm wanting to switch to the unknown USB device and click on test. And under microphone, we should get a message whether or not it's good or bad. Um, we can also switch from a built-in microphone, in my case I'm using a USB headset, to the USB device. And then once you're done with the setup, click on OK and click Call Using Computer. I'm now participating in the WebEx session and my audio is set up properly. I can now click the icon to the right of my name to start video. The one next to that is mute to mute my audio. And if I am given the privilege of being the host, I could then share out applications on my computer or share out my desktop. To end your meeting, you can simply close out of the browser. For the Mac, it's going to be the red X in the upper left hand corner. And for the PC, it's going to be closing out the window with the X in the right-hand corner. If you have questions or need additional training, please contact Samuel Williams, the Academic Technology Specialist and Trainer, at williasa at up.edu.